Right, the objects of Art Santa Fe, the materials are ranging from contemporary to historic, antique to modern, and the show offers paintings, sculpture, and fine art of all kinds. You'll find furniture, books, fashion, jewelry, textiles, and tribal folk, American Indian, African, and Asian art. And joining us now to find out more about this fantastic art event is Kim Martindale, who is the show's producer. Hello. Good, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Thank you for being with you us. Guys I know have great to be here. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. Very busy time of year in Santa Fe. Uh, so, Object Indeed. of Art actually kicks off tomorrow. Is tomorrow that right? Night. Tell, us, tell us what we can expect. You can really expect objects from around the world and exhibitors that are coming in from around the world, and they're really presenting things that many times people think of as maybe, oh, this is a painting or just a textile, but really mm -hmm. presenting in a way that these are wonderful art forms mm -hmm. okay. from many different cultures, and really the blending of those kinds of art forms is what really the show's about. That's exciting. So how has it evolved since you first started it? We started about five years ago, okay. and really with this concept of really presenting this material as art, mm -hmm. and we've really got a lot more participation from galleries from the East Coast. We have some exhibitors from South Africa this year, from Europe. Mm -hmm. So it's exciting, the melding of all of this wonderful material. Yeah. That's great. Now, one thing that I want to talk about there is a loan uh, exhibit, uh, an exhibit on loan, yes. rather, I should say, um, featuring the pottery of Margaret Tafoya. Yes. So let's talk about this. We're very excited about this exhibit. It's in conjunction with the Millicent Rogers Museum, and it's really the largest gathering of her material, her pottery, which mm -hmm. is one of the best known parlors from Santa Clara Pueblo. Okay. okay. And so we've presented an area at El Museo that's just about her pottery. There's about 25 pieces. We've painted the walls with some of her most noted symbols, the Avenue and the Bear Paw. Mm -hmm. And it's an amazing exhibition to really show that mixture of, she started doing pottery when it was really more of a, a use type More of a practical base, purpose yes. rather than and artistic. And really went sure. through that transition into where you're really creating these pieces as art objects. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so we've set it in a, in a, with a room setting of modern work and modern furniture to really showcase how wow. these pieces really accent that style and uh -huh. that development of that style. Okay. Wow. And so they've really, they really are what we call the show as well, objects of art. Objects of art, yeah. absolutely. So what, uh, what other art artists do you have? That's the main artist for this presentation. Okay. And then for the other part, we have contemporary artists like Darren V. Hill Gray, okay. who's from Santa Fe, but then material from all different cultures and time periods. That's okay. So cool. Now, you said so the objects of art this weekend, next weekend you're launching an antique American Indian show, is that right? Correct. Is that next weekend? It actually starts next Tuesday next night. Next Tuesday, okay. okay. And it runs Tuesday night with a benefit opening, mm -hmm. and then Wednesday and Thursday. You're a busy okay. guy. Yeah, this is a busy season in Santa Fe, which is an exciting season. Yeah, okay. absolutely. So, when and where can people? Can Buy tickets. Buy tickets yeah. and get more information. Go to SantaFeShows.com. Okay. okay. So that's SantaFeShows.com. And then there you can choose which other show you want to go into, their site, and okay. get a lot more information and details and purchase tickets. Fantastic. Right. So SantaFeShows.com is the hub. And for that website, head over to our website, Casa.com. Click Perfect. on the Style tab. We'll have all the information there. Well, still to come this morning, we are heading outside.